What's up everyone, JD here, and welcome back to another episode of One Perk Wraith. Today we've got the first nurse perk for you, Strider. Uh, and this makes the breathing of survivors uh, louder, um, especially so when they are injured. Uh, and you'll see this perk in use for a lot of uh, killers like Nurse and Spirit, uh, who can really take advantage of knowing exactly where survivors are, um, especially when their powers might make it a little bit more difficult to do so naturally. Uh, but Strider can also be a really good perk, just if, especially if you're learning, especially if you're uh, just starting out and you're trying to get um, a better understanding of how survivors move around and uh, get around. And it can also be a, a, a complete counter to Iron Will, uh, which a lot of really good survivors can use to... Uh, to mystify and bamboozle good killers even. So we're going to be running the Blind Warrior add-ons to uh, make them mangled and hemorrhaged to really increase the effect of them getting injured and the Swift Hunt blood in order to make sure that we can get those hits onto those survivors. So without further ado, let's get into the video. All right, so these, uh, these little gamers, these little gremlins uh, took us to Haddonfield. I will say that knowing that this garage here is closed is good oh, good for me uh except if i run into the walls there i'm gonna check out this backside and see if they're there and then head off to the left um we've got oh would you look at that there we go so this is the lorry we've got two nias i'm gonna call them skateboard nia and uh green hair nia because that's what they look like see with strider i could have just Maybe gotten very confused as to where they were. Oh, okay, hold on. We can play this pallet. Oh, is she playing it around this side? Oh, we hit her here, though. Okay. Um, not the cleanest chase. I lost her <laughs> and then <laughs> refound her, but it's a down. We'll take it. We do eventually have to go pressure other people, though. So... Just put her here. This seems to be where to put her. The rest of the map seems to be over to my right, so... No one... Oh. Hello, Jeff. I actually didn't even see him for a second. Wait. Hold on. Okay. <sighs> Shit, she has borrowed time. Wait. Oof, did he styptic or did he endurance? Fuck. So I, if he heal, yeah, that's two. That's two down. Damn. Okay, so he could have either. Yeah. Uh... Sweet. Okay, he didn't use the heal one, so I was right to hit him because it would have just given him uh, a speed boost. Okay. Well, we're gonna have to focus this Lori and this Jeff. Otherwise, uh, we're gonna have a very bad game. So, let's see if we can go after that Lori and Ping Pong and get her. Um, we don't have a ton of information or anything else, so that's kind of bad. She m may have just gone back to that gen. No, I don't hear her. She's in this house, though. Maybe healing herself up. Yep, she's getting healed. We're just going to go around. See... Yep. There we go. <laughs> that was that was probably oh shit, flashlight. Wow. That was really lucky. She just missed that. Alright, well we know where all of them are. Uh the other Nia was rescuing the Jeff and probably healing, so we're actually gonna go over there. That Lori's on death hook. But what can we do about that? Damn it. Alright, they got her. I thought they might come around the front, but not a chance. Wait, auto aim? Auto aim? Auto aim? Help. That will chase you. Because we need some okay. You're going to play around this window? We're not going to chase you then. I'm going to go chase the lorry. Screw you. Unfortunately, I don't actually know where the lorry went. <laughs> this sucks. Right here. Damn. 
Auto aim. This gen is like 99. Yeah, okay. Look at that. Sorry, Lori. Someone brought me to Haddonfield. It could have been you. I don't know. It could have been you. So we're going to bring her to this hook, and then we're just going to go try to figure out who, where else we can put pressure, because we really only have the one hook on the Jeff, and he's healed. So, sucks to be you guys. Fuck, they finished this. Okay. I'm going to kick this, because I want to like keep pressure on this. If this pops, then I lose a little bit of pressure that I would otherwise normally very much like. Now, she's just going to play around the funhouse. We're just not going to let her do that. It's fine. All right, Jeff, you're getting tunneled out next. The, uh... Oh, he can't play this. There we go. <laughs> I was going to say, that's a really, really bad one to try to play. Let's see if we can hook him somewhere. Without getting flashlighted. Yep. There we are. And this is how we're going to have to win the game. Jeff's going to be on death hook. The other two girls are either playing around Funhouse or... Going for the rescue. Okay. Do we know they're both... Oh. Hold on. I totally, I totally didn't hear her drop. Oh, well, now you get, now, nah, should have gone for the rescue. Now the other girl comes for the rescue, or this girl's fucked? And you shouldn't have dropped here. That was a bad idea. Oh, I shouldn't have swung, but you also should have, uh, <laughs> you also should have kept running. All right, she's down. They're going to be healing, and we can put her on this hook and then go back to them. And that's how we're going to have pressure. That's that's it. Now, where did they go? Here. Okay, hold on. Yeah, okay, never mind. I can't can't pressure you like that. Damn it, got caught on the geometry just a little bit. Can I get her before she gets to the window? No. Did she actually go through this window? What? Now I'm confused. There we go. She's up here. Okay. Uh, we know where they are, both of them, so we'll put her on this hook and then go chase after them. I really don't know when she went upstairs. I thought she went over to the window. That was really odd. The scratch marks seem to lead <laughs> to, well, the window. But maybe I just got outplayed. Where are they? Are they not back here? They are back here. Yeah. And this Jeff is dead if I catch him, so let's just go ahead and try to do that. Let's try to get in front of him here. Yeah, there we go. Blocked him off. And boom, shakalaka. Down goes the Jeff, unless I get flashlight saved. Which I don't think I will. I can now just bring him over to this hook. I don't even need to. There's actually a hook right here. How convenient. Bump. And let's just go and uh, say hi to these guys. Well, we see them with our eyeballs. Finally, I use my eyes instead of my ears. Uh, yeah. You might not have... Oh, hold on. Does she have balanced? She's much more likely to have balanced landing. She left. 
She's gonna play Funhouse? No. <laughs> You're not gonna play Funhouse now. She's up there? Okay, cool. We're gonna hook her, and then we know where she is now, so. Perfect. Mm. Yeah, very unfortunate. I guess we're <laughs> these guys really love the fun house, but, uh... Oh, she's just gonna keep running? Alright. Is it possible she knows where Hatch is? Oh, Alright. I heard her over there. I was like, is she gonna play the pal- Oh, she you can't play this pallet. And I hit you here. So, oh, unlucky. Very good game. Maybe if your flashlight saved me, then uh, you would have got the win. But uh, even so, I thought that was a pretty uh, pretty entertaining and well-played game. Uh, you could tell that I lost them a couple times in chase, but Strider really helped me out with that. So, Even if my game sense needs work, sometimes you can use perks like Strider to give you just a little bit of an advantage and uh, be able to track with your ears, uh, which is great. So, props to these guys. They played pretty well. They really tried to abuse this fun house, and we kind of punished them by just not giving into that and not giving them really, really long chases that they wanted. Hopefully, they're not too mad at me, but I thought that was a pretty fun game. And, uh, yeah, we got the 4K. So there we go. Okay, yeah, yeah. So, the, the person that gave us the, uh, the Haddonfield offering was one of the Nias. I don't think it was the Nia that stayed alive longer, um, but I wasn't keeping track of their names too much, so... Uh, yeah, there we go. There's uh, there's Strider, and as you can see, especially on maps like Haddonfield, where there's just like a lot of stuff around, um, and there's lots of line of sight blockers and everything, uh, it can be really useful to help find survivors, and it definitely came through um, in some really nice ways there. So that's going to be our episode of One Perk Wraith for today. Thank you guys so much for watching. I appreciate each and every one of you. Hope you guys stay safe, stay healthy, and I will see you in the next one. Bye-bye.